All right, guys, what's going on? Jamie here. Just wanted to give you a quick update here on Avaris. Um, I was able to snipe a little bit. Um, as you can see here, I went in with 40 BNB today. I did five BNB earlier. And then towards the end of the day, I was watching the um, the amount of BNB inside of the lobby. And it looked like it was going to be a low day. And in fact, it's probably one of the lower days. And I was able to put in another 35 BNB for a total of 40 and get me 86,000 tokens. I'm gonna show you here, um, I'm gonna compare it to the $50,000, well, at the time it was 50,000, I don't know what the price of BNB, but how much it would be now, but I'm gonna compare it to the 170 BNB that I put in on day five and show you why it's advantageous for you to kind of watch the BNB. And then, you know, if you can snipe and get yourself, um, Get yourself in on a lower day. Of course, before I do that, I do want to remind you guys that I am not a financial advisor. If you want financial advice, you should go seek out a professional. I'm just a guy on YouTube I'm trying to make a little bit of money here <laughs> in crypto. Um, follow me on Telegram, guys. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, of course, you should do your own research and if you're going to get into anything in crypto. Um, know that it's risky and that you should only be putting in funds you can afford to lose. So that being said, back to what I was showing you here. Um, if you guys remember back, if you watch my channel, um, back on day five, I went in with 170 BNB. And that 170 BNB, because it was a pretty big day, it was actually the second biggest day yet. Um, I was still able to get 165,000 tokens um, and then you look here today on a lower day, I put in 40 BNB, which is less than a quarter, right? Because, um, you know, a quarter, uh, 40 times four would be 160. There's 170 BNB here. So it's less than a quarter of what I put in. But if you look at how many tokens, 165,000 tokens here, there's 86,000 tokens. I got for less than a quarter of what I put in on day five, I got me half of the tokens that I got. Make sense? So all of that just to say that when the lobby go when the when it's a low day in the lobby you're going to get way more tokens for your BNB right so you you can stretch out your BNB you get more bang for your buck um, um, you know when you're going in on a lower day so it pays to kind of watch and snipe towards the end of the day um, and you know try to get you you know try to enter the lobby and get you some BNB on a low day so. Pretty awesome. I'm pretty excited about that because, you know, ever since I put that 170 BNB, obviously I don't regret putting the 170 BNB. I got me a nice big fat stake uh, working for me. That's just, you know, racking up BNB divs. But since it was like the second biggest day, I was always like, man, I wish I had put that in on, on a different day. Now, of course, you can't predict these days. If I had waited the next day, it would have been 3000. It would have been, been even worse. Right. Um, but because I was able to get in on a low day here, it kind of averaged out a little bit and I actually feel way, way better. <laughs> so let me stake these. I'm gonna show you what the stakes are doing right now. They're still doing about eight to 10%. So, I mean, you can't, where are you gonna get eight to 10% in a bear market? Um, let me go ahead and collect these right here. Collect my 86,000 tokens. Um, I mean, in a bear market the way it is right now, and you're getting eight to ten percent. Um, I mean, where else are you going to do that, right? So, Avarice is doing great, and it's printing right now. And if you can, if you can get yourself in on one of these days, it's still early days. I mean, you, you think about it; it's, it's not even two weeks. Like tomorrow will be day thirteen, right? Um, tomorrow will be day thirteen. It hasn't even been two weeks yet that this thing has been live. And the last project that the developer did, which was T2X, um, it ran for a year, more than a year. Pretty good, right? So we're still early dates, right? Yes, we are in a bear market. Yes, people are losing money in their portfolio. <laughs> yes, the value of BNB is you know tanking. Yes, 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 right? But what am I going to do? Sit with BNB in my wallet and just watch the value go down? No, I'm going to put it in something like this and try to make some money, right? But that's just me. I'm a, I'm a risk taker. If you've been watching my channel, if you've been a subscriber to my channel, you know that I am pretty. Uh, I have a pretty high risk tolerance. Not saying you should do that, right? Don't do what I do. 
Um, so here you can look at the stakes right here. This was the stake that paid out today um, on 5 BNB. So yeah, it's about 10%, nine, eight, nine, 10%. I didn't do the math, but it's anywhere between eight to 10%. Um, you can see here the divs that are stacking up. This one right here, 83 BNB already. And a uh, total is 126 BNB that I have stacked up right here. And it just stacks up every day. Every day at 8 p.m. Eastern, boom, you know, just <laughs> BNB continues, continues to stack up. And then one of, once these stakes start to mature, I'll be able to scrape this BNB, right? Put that BNB in my wallet and then take these tokens and restake them, wash, rinse, repeat. Of course, if I, if I didn't want to wait till the end of my stake, I can always... Uh, participate in the lending, which I, I may very well do that. I don't know yet. I have, I'm still kind of studying that a little bit. But that's a whole other component. But um, what I'm going to do here, and I'm going to kind of play around with the strategy. This strategy may backfire. Okay, so don't do this. Don't copy me. I'm just I'm I'm experimenting here. Right? But I'll take these tokens right here, eighty nine thousand eight hundred forty nine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a ten day stake. Right. Because my thought process is, if it if it's paying out ten percent a day, now again, some days you know it'll be like eight to ten percent, right? But I'm too lazy to pull out a calculator and do all that stuff. I'm just going to say it pays out ten percent, right? Of course, we'll see what happens here. I'll guarantee that it's going to pay ten percent every single day. But if I do a ten day stake and it averages ten percent, just for simple math, at the end of ten days, that'll be a hundred percent. I should have my B and B. I should be able to pull out the same amount of BNB that I put in here, which was 40, right? And then I, if I pull out that BNB, now I have these 89,000 tokens to restake again and wash, rinse, repeat. And now I've essentially pulled my money, my, my initial out, right? And now I just have these tokens racking up dividends for me or however, however long or however short I stake them, right? Now, is this strategy foolproof? No, I'm going to experiment. I'm going to see what happens, right? It may not work exactly the way I, I think it'll work. Um, so we'll see. I mean, what's the worst thing that can happen? I'll just, you know, restake them, right? Um, so let's go ahead and stake these and see what happens here. So again, I'm going to play around with my strategy here for the low, for the, Lower amount of B and B that I go in with, I can always stake those for you know two weeks, thirty days. Set up these ladder stakes for these bigger, chunky, chunkier ones. Um, I'm doing shorter stakes so I can you know get my money back and then just wash, rinse, repeat, and uh, you know play around with it, see see what happens there. Again, it's all a learning experience. Um, either way, you know I'm going to be making dibs, right? So. Yeah, this thing is, uh, let me see here, let me refresh. All right, so it's here, stake right here, okay? Um, so yeah, 126 BNB right here. Um, lobby already, it's just, it's been, a, what is that, two hours? Not even, yeah, like less than two hours and already 127 BNB. You know, if it's a short, if it's a, if it's a, a, a low day, I'm gonna watch it again and try to get more tokens for the same amount. To try to you know average out my cost for this uh, bigger buy here that was on the second biggest day. Um, but overall, super pumped. You know what? What more can you ask for? The thing is working. It's working as it as it should in a bear market like this. You know, and you have you, you have something that's printing out dividends and it's working the way it should. What else can you ask for? Right? What else can you ask for? Um, <laughs> So that being said, um, you want to follow my journey with this, subscribe to my channel, hit the little bell icon so you'll get notified straight away whenever I do a brand new video. Follow me on Telegram. Of course, this is all high risk, guys. Don't do as I do. You can just watch me. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just a guy on YouTube, right? Trying to make a, a dollar out of 50 cents. You're trying to make some money. So again, don't copy me. I'm not an advisor. I'm not giving you financial advice. It's all risky. If you're going to get in, only put in risk capital, guys, okay? All right, guys, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.